Cancer, July 2018 general reading. Cancer, July 2018 general reading. Cancer, July 2018. The bigger I get these out, you're the first one. First one to get them for July. Wanted to get them out before July, as you know. Got to do it. Got to get it out there. Completion. You're still not over something, maybe. It's a whole overall energy, or someone's not over a certain situation with you. The completion has not occurred. Also, is also known as the four of uh, rods. And with that, or wands, whatever you want to call it, but it's there's like you're not quite happy in the beginning energy for July. Truth came out. That's uh, basically the current environment, the subject at hand. Let's see what's crossing the swords. That's when someone getting their truth out, or a truth does come out, and someone may not like what they hear. See what the goal is for cancer. Where's your goal, cancer? Or what you're heading for. You're wanting to end something. That's the death card there. So truth came out. Four of cups crossing it. Not liking what you were offered or heard or someone didn't like it from you. And the goal is to end something. I don't know what it is. We'll, we'll use clarifying cards in, in just a few minutes, but I need to know what the foundation is first. What is the foundation for cancer in this spread? The, can, uh, the foundation for cancer, July 2018. Walking away. Let's see what happened in the past. That's the Eight of Cups. Becoming unchained. You were chained to a certain situation, and now you're not. But I'm going to clarify that. Foundation, you got the Eight of Cups. That's someone walking away, but sorrowfully. You know, they weren't happy about it. They're not feeling joyous about it. But they feel like we must walk away and end something for cancers. Okay. Near future. Now, this could take anywhere from three days to three weeks often, the near future. If it's a pentacles, it could be even longer. It is a pentacles. Uh, eight of pentacles in reverse. No longer wanting to work with something. Now, possible future outcome advice is the eight of uh, wands. It's in reverse. It's like you don't want communication. You don't want to talk to somebody. You're really put out with somebody. You're not chained to them anymore. So if this is for you, this resonates with you, you definitely wanted to put something behind you, something that was not benefiting you, because uh, you got rid of a chain situation in the past. Now what's coming towards you, Cancer? Or what people are thinking? They're thinking, they're thinking, you know, people are thinking you don't want to fight, or they don't want to fight with you. I see someone wanting to possibly come out of wanting an argument with you. They're not wanting to fight with you. Or maybe they're not wanting to fight for this cause. Hopes and fears. Move these cards out of the way. Hopes and fears of cancer. Oops, that wants to come out. Your fear is maybe something will come out. Or your hope is that maybe something will come out. This is a moon reverse. And um, maybe... I'm, I'm thinking you're fearing, you're wanting the, like the ugly just to go away and, and whatever occurred. That could be your goal, is walking away from all the ugly and the bad omens that came upon you. Outcome. And we're going to clarify these. Find out why. Outcome for cancer. What happened here? Princess of Wands in reverse. I'm going to need no more than that. I'm going to need more than that. And the Queen of Cups, you in reverse as overall, overall energy. I don't know who the Princess of Wands yet. Let's find out who the Princess of Wands are in a minute. But we're going to find out why we have the Ace of Swords. 
we got to find out why the Ace of Swords is there. And why the Four of Cups, why either you are not liking what is offered or somebody else is not liking what is offered. Okay, so the Ace of Swords, let's try to flip up. Someone, something from something in the past. Well, it's trying to come out. Again, the Five of Swords in reverse. It's from someone in the past. And that Five of Swords is like someone's not wanting to fight, not, not liking what is offered. But you're going to have your say or someone's going to have their say with you. Let's find out what the death is. The death card. This is your goal. This is what you're heading for. This is what you're maybe wanting or maybe it's something you're trying to avoid. But let's find out for sure. The death card. Why are you there? The death card. Why are you there for cancer? Now, you're not willing even, to, even to contemplating on anything. You're just wanting it something over. Eight of Cups. Eight of Cups. Why are you there? Eight of Cups. Why are you there is the foundation. What's going on? Why are you walking away? Not walking away too fast. Probably from trying to manifest something. You're trying to make your life better. Uh, with the uh, Chariot Reverse, sometimes it's about going, going forward when it's in the upright. In reverse, it's not going forward or stop in a chaotic situation. You're not willing to go along with a chaotic situation. The Magician in the Upright is a good card when I read them because, geez, she's just wanting to pop out of here. The Magician can manifest things. They got tools. They got knowledge. They got skills. That's, way, that's, like, that's what I like to call it, skills. And you see your better things coming in with the Three of Wands. You're walking away because you want better things coming because you know you've got the ability to manifest what you want. In the past, you were chained to a, a situation. It's in reverse. You, you, you must have been chained for at, at first, and then it turned around and you became unchained. So in the recent past, you decide to become unchained, no longer chained to this situation. Why are you there, devil, in reverse? Hermit in reverse. Yep, you're coming out of hermit mode. You no longer keep to yourself and quiet. In the past, you decided no more chained, no more hiding away, no more thinking. I think it's recent for a lot of you, but you just made it. You just may have decided that I'm not. I'm not going to stand for this. I don't know why those words came out. Um, Eight of Pentacles in reverse. Why are you there? Eight of Pentacles in reverse. Why are you there? Yeah, you're no longer willing to work or carry this burden. That's the Ten of Wands in reverse. You're no longer wishing to carry a burden. Eight of Wands. Why are you in reverse is a possible future outcome. That means you're not wanting to talk to somebody. I believe that's maybe your feeling. Yeah, you're wanting happiness. I think you feel like it's better to... I'm happier when I don't have to communicate this with this situation. You're looking for happiness as the outcome. And by doing that is not the exchange messages right now. Not in July. Something must have happened. Even in the comments if you want. Uh, five of Swords coming towards you. It's in reverse. Someone may want to come out of uh, fighting with you, but I'm not sure. Let's find out. Five of Swords in reverse. Why are you there? King of Pentacles, it could have a lot to do, it may be somebody else here coming towards you that maybe doesn't want to fight, or maybe wants to calm you down. King of Pentacles is in the upright, is someone who's stable, sound, um, wise, mature. I'm trying to think, like, they're kind of handsomely good looking. I'm not talking in male form, I mean they're just attractive in some ways and just not over looks. It's their personality. It's how they carry themselves. And maybe they're gonna they're gonna come towards you about putting your swords down possibly for some of you. For others it may be that someone wants you to put your swords down permanently and stop fighting with them. Or maybe for some of you someone you some of you had a battle with an earth sign. It could be a, a Virgo, Capricorn, 
Taurus. And I'm thinking maybe you had an out. So some of you may have a, a, a parting of the ways with somebody in the past. An argument. Maybe they're coming towards you maybe with a peace offering. But I'm seeing for a lot of you, you're not accepting a peace offering. Maybe not from them or with somebody else. And maybe someone else is coming towards you also. Maybe I'm feeling like some of you that... This person knows maybe you had a splitting up. This is just for some of you, that you split up with somebody and now they see an opportunity to come in. Just saying for some of you. Now your hopes and fears, that moon card. I never liked the moon card. So I can understand why anyone would fear the moon card. But it's in reverse, so maybe you're hoping a bad omen is over a bad situation. The moon, why are you in reverse for cancer? Yeah, you got hope. You got hope that you're definitely hoping for a better situation and maybe all this negativity be gone. Now, as, as the ending energy right there, you got the Princess of Wands, the outcome. She is in reverse. This is not your energy. So let's find out. Princess of Wands, why are you there? Why are you the outcome? It could be a fire sign, but someone carrying that energy also. It doesn't have to be a fire sign. It's uh, It could be an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Usually they're about, when I do readings, it's usually about 30s to mid-40s sometimes. Uh, could be younger. Pis a princess could be younger. But Princess of Wands, why are you there? Why are you the outcome? Why are you in reverse for Cancer? Yeah, there's that moon card again. You're th Be careful of this energy at the end don't be so upset in your life that you trust the wrong people okay so you know watch your back this is your also your energy the moon so you could also use your intuition I need another card for the moon card and the princess of wands queen of swords yeah someone may tell you something about this princess of wands in the end, you may get some clarity. You may get the truth because the beginning energy is the truth. Let me say one more card. This isn't telling us. I'm thinking someone's going to tell you something about the about the Princess of Wands. Queen of Swords is going to tell you. Queen of Swords can be an air sign, but it's, a, it's someone who likes to speak the truth and and they don't mince words. They're going to straight out tell you something about a moon situation. So listen to the Queen of Swords. Queen of Swords, why are you there? Why are you there, Queen of Swords? Yeah, she's going to tell you someone's not um, who they say they are. They're, they're probably saying they're going to help you. They're doing this and that for you, but really they're not working at all because you got the Two of Pentacles is in reverse, and the Queen of Swords is going to let out a little known secret. It could be an air sign or just someone who's really honest, truthful, straightforward, and like I said, doesn't uh, dance around their words. could be because someone was uh, dealing with uh, options here. What they call this the options card? It is the Seven of Cups, but it's also someone who makes bad decisions or everything that's out there is, is not a good option for them. They've got a whole bunch of them, but it's not exactly anything... Anything there is not exactly what they want in the long run. So be careful of what you're choosing. That's what I'm getting. And be careful of, of people deceiving you and um, lying to you and doing things behind your back. And the Queen of Swords will tell you something, but don't look negatively on the Queen of Swords because she is in the upright and trying to help you. So the Queen of Swords trying to help you against a possible negative situation that you didn't know about and they may bring it to light, and you may fear that that truth, but don't, because it'll set you free. You're going to be unchained, remember? You're becoming unchained. So the truth will set you free, and you will you will enjoy your life again, Cancer. You're just going through the motions. You are becoming unchained. You are walking away from a negative situation, and that is your uh, July reading, and I'll talk to you later, and I'll be back around, I don't know, maybe mid-July. Bye.